Happy Folk Store Friday. I'm Ruth McWilliams. I'm on Tawny's Board of Directors. I'm also co-curator of the St. Lawrence County Barn Quilts Exhibit with Camilla Emirati, and I am a barn quilter. I love teaching students of all ages. And today we are focusing on high school students here in St. Lawrence County who have painted barn quilts at Canton Central School, Clifton Fine, and Colton Pierpont. And I'm going to start right here with some barn quilts done by students at Canton Central School. Their teacher, Greg Kaya, says, I was driving down Judson Street Road the first week in January and noticed a big, vibrant barn quilt on the garage of a home belonging to one of my students. I asked my advanced studio art class if they would be interested in creating some, and they eagerly accepted the challenge. Two of the students accepting the challenge are Kelsey Whittier and Bella Jaskowski. In Clifton, through a Save Our School committee, students are involved in working with adults in the community. One of the designs they've painted is the Striking Mountain design. Another one is the ever popular maple leaf, and maple leaves are pretty prevalent around St. Lawrence County. The third design and a favorite of mine is this dragonfly. And the fourth is a traditional bear paw design, which they've also replicated on note cards. Now I'd like to move over here and talk a bit about barn quilts being done by students at Colton Pierpont Central School. Art teacher Crystal Hewer actually involves students starting in the fourth grade. She teaches the barn quilt painting technique actually with my help to students to paint murals as well as barn quilts to sell. This mural was done during the winter to commemorate 100 years of progress from 1920 to 2020. And the design includes a one-room schoolhouse from the 1920s and the front of the current school along State Highway 56. Crystal's motto is, make art, make money. And some of the students at Colton Pierpont have accepted her challenge. They've been inspired by the towns of St. Lawrence County Barn Quilt Mural that was painted right here in the lower level last summer by 25 painters. Michael Schwartfiger likes to paint maple leaf designs, and this one was inspired by the design in the mural representing the history of the town of Edwards. The next barn quilt painted by students is the village green design, which in the mural is for the town of Hopkinton. The third design that's available here in the online shop to purchase is a hunter star design. This striking design was inspired by the green and white hunter star design in the mural for the town of Fine. And the fourth barn quilt available is this dashing geese design. It was inspired by two designs in the mural, the orange and brown design for the town of Louisville, that's a flying geese design. And the one next to it is a churn dash design for the town of Macomb. These barn quilts, as I mentioned, are available in Tawny's online shop. But there are also other murals available to purchase by barn quilters in the county, including this woven star design painted by Joan Olin right here in Canton. When you buy products from Tawny's online shop, you're not only supporting Tawny, but you're supporting the artists who have painted them. We would appreciate your support. Thank you very much.